Hello guys, welcome back to another video, and today we're going to be doing Build Vote for Treasure Part Something because I can't remember. So today we are going to be, um, well, we're going to be making so you can't build outside a, like a kind of bounding box, I guess. So yeah. Okay, so let's get right into it. So what we're going to do is, first let's just go into blue team because it's like the first one there. And then let's add a new folder. And first of all, I don't like the change in textures. I'm just saying, it doesn't look good. Alright, but, uh, what? You can't, you can't double click anymore? Oh, that's annoying. Okay, well, let's make a new folder called bounds. And then inside of here, let's add another folder. Let's call this X. And another folder inside of that called Z. Okay. And you know what? Can this like be first or something? Here. There, okay, because I like Z I like X before Z, it just looks better. Okay, and then in here, let's put in a number value. Oh no, I don't like that texture. I guess it's fine though. That's not what I want to do. What? Okay, no, I'm just I'll just copy it, or I'll just duplicate it. Okay, so this first value, let's call it x1, then x2, then in here we'll do the same. This is z1, this is z2, okay, and uh, Let's just get a part out here and make the size. Where is that? Out here. Okay. Make it one by one. Oh, one by one by one. There. All right. Yeah, so we're gonna have to do this for every single side, but oh, it's on 0.5 subs. Why can't I move it over there? Oh, there. Okay. So you gotta put it on the corner, like 0.5 studs off, and then 0.5 stu studs off on this side. And to make it easier in the code, we're going to be getting this side, and this side, then this side, and this side, then this side, and this side. It, it'll make more sense when we actually do it. Alright, so, here, the position is 3, whatever. <laughs> this is the X, so we'll copy this, and since this is blue, this is red team, I need to... Okay, okay, copy the bounds and put it into every other team. Paste into and paste into. Okay, so this is red team. <laughs> so let's go to red team. And let's go into bounds, X, X1. So the position is this. Let's put it in here. And then the Z is this. Oh, I guess that works. Let's put it here. And then, oh, you gotta move this over to this side. Put that, put that here. And then get this position. Set it to X2. Get this position. Set it to Z2. Alright. Then we can do the same for white team. I know this is kind of boring, but like, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? Alright. So. Get that, and this is for white team. So X1, bam, and then, oh, and then Z1. Oh, okay. Then let's go over to here, and we'll set this one. Uh, okay, so X2, oh, X2, and then copy 
copy that, paste it here, and then since it's also on the corner for blue, we can just copy that. So the X, then you gotta go up to blue. So the X, X1 is this. Z1 is, oh, that's for white team. Z1 is this. Okay. And then this one, copy that. And, okay. Paste it there. Wait a second. Did I do something wrong? Because why was that one already set? Huh. Wait. This one already set? Oh, what? What did I do here? Oh, this is red team. Oh, no. What crimes have I just committed? There, okay. Now it, it should be back. Yes, okay, it's back. Okay, I just control Z twice. It saves the day. Okay, well that could have been a disaster. Whole video down the drain. Alright, okay. that's the red team again. Uh, okay, set that. And then... Wait. Oh, uh huh. And then... What did I just do? What did I just do? Oh, ha, I said the wrong thing. That sounds like something I would do. Okay. <laughs> so I just set the wrong value. So we gotta grab that one and put it here. And then grab this one and put it here. Okay, finally, we've done it. Oh, what? Z, the first Z, didn't put that, what, that's crazy, we got the first X, what happened to the first Z, oh wait, oh this is white team, huh, yeah what happened to the first Z, wait, what, what's the value here, um, it's 147, negative 147, or 49. What does it look like for this one? No. That, that, w that would make sense. What about this one? Oh, no. Um, wait, would this be 147? Oh, it would be 147. Oh, okay. Heh, <laughs> we didn't do anything wrong. We just forgot to set it. Okay, well, that was like a bit of a waste of time. Okay, well, I'm going to delete that. And, okay. So let's actually get onto the coding part. So we can close all these up. And we can add a, or not add, go into uh, local script. Yep. Go to this place where it activates it. Let's make a local var variable. Let's call it spawnable. Set it to false. And in here, let's first check if spawnable. So if spawnable, if spawnable, then, and we're gonna put this inside of here. So it will only run if it's spawnable. And here we'll make spawnable true if it's in the right position. So we're gonna say if object dot primary part dot uh, position dot x is greater than workspace find first child player player's a thing, right? Player yes, okay. Dot team dot name. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna 
I'm gonna be nice. I'm gonna make a variable over here. Okay, I'm gonna call it uh, local team is equal to that. And we're gonna say team dot bounds dot x dot x one <laughs> dot value. Then if object, you know, I'm just gonna copy this. There is less than team dot bounds dot x dot x2 dot value. Well, that's not high school value. Dot value. Then and we're gonna do the same thing for the um z's so we're just going to change these x's to z's all right and inside of here we're just going to simply say spawnable oh <laughs> spawnable i spawnable equals true and that should work Let's just save that. Click play. Um, <laughs> I don't know what that was all about. Close that. Okay. So, let's pull out our build. We can't build here. That's great. <laughs> no, it's probably the other way around. If it isn't, then something is wrong with the world. Okay. There we go. Does it work? It doesn't. Um. Hmm. What just happened? Why is it doing that? It is fine, I guess. What? Okay. Doesn't work for some reason. That's cool. Wait, what happens if we eliminate this bit of code here? Yeah, what happens? Does it still run? <laughs> it still runs. Uh, hmm, that's a bit odd. Yeah, I'm gonna run it again. Let's try and find the culprit. I'm on white team now. Doesn't work on white team. What about red team? Red team doesn't work. Blue team doesn't work. What? Uh huh. Um, why? Exactly. Okay, I'm I'm gonna try something. So, oh, I, it got rid of all my things. Where? It's not output. I want. No, not that. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, I want these. Okay. Oh, those are really tiny. What? What? Properties. Can I? What? I can't pull it out. Uh, uh, um, that's a bit of a problem. Just, just maybe. Um, float. There we go. Dock? Wait, collapse. That doesn't help at all. Can you just like get bigger? Like seriously. What is that? Float. Bro. Um. <sighs> what? Oh, 
Okay, okay. Since my game is glitching, I'm going to have to explain to you guys what to do. Because I can't show you. So, since you start here and have over here. Or, actually, the second X is going to be over here. This is the first X, this is the second X. If this one's greater, so it depends on which way your game is facing. So, if this one, if this X is greater than this X, like, if this, this guy's X is greater than this guy's X, then you have to say if X, if X1 is greater than X2. Or, okay, <laughs> if, uh, if the block is greater than, uh, x1 if and if it's less than x2 but if it's the other way around just flip that and the same thing for z if it's oh if this is the if this is z1 and this is z2 you look at this z and this z if this one's greater or wait you know what okay fine i'm, I'm just gonna keep explaining if this one's greater than this one then you'll say if the part is less than um or, yeah, if it's less than Z1 and greater than Z2. So, yeah, that's what you're going to do. It depends on the way that you made your game. Okay. Well, that is it for this video because for some reason my properties is really tiny. And I can't really do anything about that. But, uh, yeah. Other than that, uh, that's basically it. And bye.